Hey, what is up everybody? It is AJ here and in today's video, I'm gonna show you the easiest way to share a YouTube video in Microsoft Teams without any lag. Sharing a YouTube video in Microsoft Teams should be easy, but a lot of people share it the wrong way and you end up getting a disconnect between the audio and the video and it's stuttering and it doesn't play right and you end up just leaving that video behind because it just doesn't work well at all. So in this video, I'm gonna show you an easy way of sharing a YouTube video in Microsoft Teams teams without any lag. Of course, if you like this video, let me know by giving a thumbs up. If you're going to supercharge to raise your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. With that being said, let's get into this. So I'm signed here into Microsoft Teams on the web on a Mac, and I'm also going to show you what the other experience looks like on uh, Microsoft Teams on a PC to show you the experience is the exact same. So we're in a call with Alan and Alex, and the first thing we're going to do is go into the top right hand corner of Teams and select on the apps where you can add an app. From here, we're gonna search for the YouTube app. If it's not in your recent section, which it probably isn't, you can just simply search for it and then go add the app. It's gonna pop up and tell you a little bit about getting started with YouTube in Microsoft 365. Then you're simply gonna select on the save option and this is gonna add the YouTube app into this call. Give it a couple of seconds and it will appear in the top right hand corner. So you can see here, it's now started getting connected to the live session. And basically what this means is that both on your computer and every other participant in the call, they've had their YouTube app quickly installed into that meeting. And from here, you can do a few things. You can either copy and paste a YouTube URL and paste it up here, or you can search straight from YouTube via this, this link up here, or via this chat section. So I'm gonna search for a video. We're gonna say Microsoft Surface Pen, because you may have just got a new Microsoft Surface, and you wanna show everybody the ways of setting it up. So you can see here, we're searching YouTube. We found a video that we wanna watch. You can select on the option of add to queue. And this means you can have multiple videos lined up for everybody to watch and you can jump between them. Or you can simply select the one video you wanna to watch together. I'm gonna to show you what the queue looks like. So I'm gonna add this video and I'm gonna search again and I'm gonna add this video here. You can see here that we have a queue lined up. So we'll jump on the PC. Let's see what this looks like from somebody else's point of view. You can see that from their point of view, they have the exact same queue lining up, and then you have the button of watch together. If we select on the watch together option, this is gonna start the video for everybody. So I'm gonna jump back on the Mac now and select watch together. And then the video is gonna start playing on all the computers joined in this call, and of course, even if you're on, say, a mobile phone as well. Because this is streaming from the internet from YouTube directly to everybody. This is where the magic really happens that it allows you to watch lagless, lossless videos because it's just like streaming it directly from YouTube except it's in the Microsoft Web, Microsoft Teams browser. From here, we can start, pause, play, and fast forward the video. But on the bottom right-hand corner, we can actually turn on an option called group, uh, group controls as well. This means that anybody in the call can actually speed up, slow down, or change where we are in the video. I'm gonna press play now just to show you what happens on both computers when we select play. Hey, AJ here. Welcome, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show You can see that on both computers or on all the computers here, the video just starts playing straight away. I'm gonna jump over to the PC now and show you what the group controls allow you to do. So we're on the PC and I wanna actually fast forward this bit to jump to around minute five. I select to minute five and both computers just naturally jump to that section within you know less than a second because group controls are turned on. If we, if we press play from the PC now, watch on the Mac, it also starts playing at the exact same time. Anywhere I sign, I'm gonna get a new signature. I'm gonna add in my name. Here. There's also a really cool feature in YouTube app via Microsoft Teams is where you select on the settings cog, you can turn on something called smart audio. When smart audio is turned on, it basically adjusts the audio of the video when people are talking. So if you're not talking, the video is gonna play at full volume. But if you start talking, it's gonna lower the volume of the video so people can hear you talking over it. And I think this is a really great way to enable collaboration without pausing the video completely. And there you have it. It is that easy to share YouTube videos with lossless playback through Microsoft Teams. You also get some added features like group controls, adding cues, and of course that smart audio so you can keep talking and collaborating even when you're not in the same room without having to pause the video. Of course, if you like this video, let me know by giving a thumbs up and if you want to supercharge your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye.